Good evening. Good evening. Welcome. I remember uh, when I was a boy, when I was around 10, 12, 13. Don't know what, 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 if that is a boy, actually. <laughs> but I, I remember when I was young, um, there was this particular woman that um, anytime I saw, I don't know, but I always felt a bit uh, sad whenever I saw that woman. And my thought was that uh, if I grew, you know, when I grew up, I would do something to make that woman happy, to make that woman lively. I don't know. Maybe it, uh, I never saw her smile. It was something I always thought about. Now, why is this woman that quiet and calm and always, you know, thinking? And it, it, it appeared to me that she was a bit worried of life. And growing up, I've seen that um, if you don't take care, uh, you will never enjoy your life. If you don't take care, you will perpetually live in, in worry and in pain. And you will perpetually postpone your enjoyment and the fun that life is lived once and uh, the, the, there are so many troubles in life there are so many challenges in life there are so many responsibilities in life that if you don't take care you will never ever enjoy your life but i think that life it was created to be enjoyed in spite of um, all the challenges all the difficulties all the things that come Sorry, the network went off. Uh, in spite of all the difficulties, in, fact, in spite of all the challenges that come, you know, with life, we are still to condition ourselves to enjoy life. And I think when you have, a, when you come from a background that um, you experience a lot of luck and a lot of challenges and a lot of pain, a lot of difficulties, you have, you know, you have that tendency to always be in haste to become something and that if you don't take care you or you will overlook all the fun or the enjoyment that you have to have because not having fun does not really mean that you becoming successful or uh, or you are becoming somebody who is achieving something with their life so uh, a lot of people uh, are, are, are driven easily you know a lot of people can easily lose sight of the fact that they have to enjoy their life as well why because <laughs> the challenges are many by the time that you become responsible for your life uh, you don't have time to enjoy you don't have time to have fun if you become say a business person the challenges are many if you become you know if you're a professional if you are working the, 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 you know there are challenges yet we just have to have a way of it, of living this life and having some kind of fun there are some people when you are around them you will never have fun <laughs> you never you can't even smile you can't even laugh you can't even create jokes because everything around them is that much uh, you know serious but i think you should you should enjoy your life so it's easier to enjoy life when you're very much positive of life it's very much easier when you're very much positive, optimistic of life than when you're negative and very uh, pessimistic of life. So for you to enjoy life, you have to have some positive outlook of life. You have to develop yourself to be a little bit uh, light. And sometimes, uh, I dare say that sometimes there are some issues that you may have to take them a bit lightly on yourself. Not because the issues are light, but because you just have to have a way of enjoying life. You just have to have a way of enjoying life. Because if you don't enjoy life, <laughs> life will kill you quick. Some people cannot even accept praise and compliments. They take everything seriously. When you look at them, say, ah, you have a nice shoe. So this is why I went to Bakula to buy you is second hand. So I like your jewelry. And they want to talk it down. 
Uh, today you are you are looking lively, gorgeous, and most people cannot take compliment. Why? Because they take life so seriously. If somebody praises your shoe, if somebody praises your work, just say thank you, thank you. I, I you know I can do that as well. <laughs> Make fun. Life is not supposed to be killing and other things that people uh, because. Yes, we have to achieve our dreams. We have to be purposeful. We have to be serious in life. But being serious does not mean that you have to have a, a face that nobody can approach. And you have to live a life that is weird, you know. So, create jokes, laugh, smile. It is part of life. As a matter of fact, people who achieve a lot, most people who achieve a lot, have a way of life that makes people around them a bit more comfortable and have fun with and smile with so if you don't have that kind of disposition you know some people appear uh, much serious uh, myself some people say that i when they don't, when they don't know you <laughs> when they don't know me they think that uh, i look more serious and I, I don't consider myself serious i consider myself as somebody who's a bit light and crack jokes but uh, you know so have fun have fun have fun have that disposition to have fun not everything is hell and fire not everything is going to die not everything is coming to an end so things that make a lot of people worry you know when there is worry you don't think of um, uh, enjoying life and many people uh, from my little experience worry about a lot of things in life a lot of people worry about finances that's a major thing on their scale. A lot of people worry about their relationships. People have marital problems, marital issues, relationship problems. People have issues with their children, their work environment. Some people is business partners. People have issues, you know. Some people have issues with their health, with their career, with their education, all kind of things. I think that in this life, everybody has something that at any point in time they're dealing with. So don't make your case uh, that much special. Everybody, even the people that you look up to, the people that you so much admire, they may have overcome the finances, but they may have some challenges somewhere. It could be health, it could be their relationship, it could be something, you know? Everybody is not everything together. There is something that everybody else has to, you know, constantly uh, uh, overcome and deal with. So don't let that which is bothering you at this moment in your life take the joy uh, uh out of it there's no point spending all your life or, or living your life worrying 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 some people worry so much to the point that they become depressed and some of them even take their own lives you know they commit suicide because they worry and usually the worry is what they think that maybe they are around 40 50 and they think that they have wasted their lives they think that, uh, you know, life has no meaning. Some of them think that they have made so much mistakes. Some of them, you know, the things that their colleagues have gone ahead of them. Or the things that people think about. They think that they, this is not the life they, they, they envisage when they were young. I don't think. There's a difference between worrying and, there's a, there's a, and, and planning and projecting for the future. When you project for the future, you are looking at strategy. You're looking at how to live the life that you want. When you worry, you become helpless. You become powerless. You, you, you feel like a victim. That's why you become uh, that much discouraged. So dwelling on the things that are around your life that you think are not the way that you expected them to be is that which makes you to uh, take for granted the fact that life is meant to be enjoyed. Believe it or not, life it's meant to be enjoyed and, 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 and to have fun with, you know. <laughs> so <laughs> turn these things into fun and enjoy them as well because every one of us has something that we can enjoy. Every one of us has something our, around our lives that we can enjoy. Business people, you started a business, you, you, are, you are in a situation where everything is breaking, everything is being destroyed, everything that you ever thought was going to work now is not working. And you are very much uh, disappointed in yourself. You are very much discourage you don't want to see people listen the fact is you are not god okay so life is meant to be a joy life is meant to be a joy so enjoy have fun enjoy life uh, um, don't 
Don't make everything seem like <laughs> you are God. You can't control everything. The fact that you know that you're not God is that when your best friend or when, when your family member is gone and they, they are in there, you know, when they, they die and they are, uh, they, they, they dress them in the, in the bed, in the lying state or something, they say, uh, if you're that much powerful, you will go there and wake them up, you know. So the fact that you love that person so much and yet you can't do something about it shows your humanity. And so life was meant to be enjoyed. So have fun. There are so many problems I talked about that can take uh, your, your, your eye out of the fun and out of the enjoyment that you have to have. You know, so everyone and everyone, there are, there are things that we love to do. There are things that we love to do. What is it that you love to do? Is it sports? Is it entertainment? Is it reading? Is it watching video? Is it music? Is it eating? Some people just have fun. They like eating. They like doing some things with their friends. You know, they gather the boys, they go and uh, pound fufu. Or they, you know, the things that people do to have fun. Once in a while, have time to, you know, some people I like. Uh, what I like is um, when I meet some people that I can discuss some things, you know, wait. I think that is fun for me. And um, so it's you. I also think that when I move, when I move around, when I am working, it's also fun for me. I don't know what you like about fun. I'm not the type that will go to the sports stadium and watch video and watch uh, football or go to the to the beer bar and drink with friends. I'm not that kind of person. But whatever your lifestyle, I like music. I like watching some video. I like training myself, you know. So have fun. Have fun. Maybe you like going to the malls to look at the shops, even if you don't have money. Just look out and uh, just go around and ask them how much is this, you know, and post like the money is there. Just have fun, crack jokes. It is life, it's one is lived, you know. So there are a lot of fun that you can see. Uh, when you start uh, 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 to, to, some people have fun because they, they, they realize their dreams. Sometimes something that was so much uh, worrying you when you're able to achieve it is at that point you become very much you know elated and uh, that is fun enjoy, enjoy it you know celebrate it when your dreams come true but there's a little that people who don't have a lot of uh, financial leverage uh, can enjoy so maybe in the midst of the fun Look at how you can overcome some of the financial challenges as well because uh, when you're even enjoying and you remember that <laughs> it becomes a pain but every one of us has one person two people who love us no matter our mistakes no matter our problems no matter our challenges no matter the, our errors get around those people always get around those people it's dangerous for anybody to be depressed it's dangerous for anybody to separate themselves in, in the moment that they feel like this is the worst state that I've ever been don't separate yourself look for those who have your interest just go and cook some food just go and chat with them some of them can go and read the Bible pray together but have fun don't separate yourself because life it's not only tough for you, it's almost tough for everyone. Everyone. Not everybody has covered all the problems. Some people have covered the money problem, some people have covered the relationship problem, some people have covered, you know. But some everybody has, has something that they're dealing with. So don't make your space your case that special. Have fun. Enjoy your life. Some enjoyment can come from you reading a book. Some enjoyment can come from you. Whatever that you do to make light life light for you too some people have children that they you know they like moving around with some people just can go to the village and 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 hang out uh, hang out with their with their old friends and crack all the jokes it's good for 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 living once in a while you just have to make sure that you can you know clear out some of the <laughs> some of the uh, the baggage of the baggage of some of the baggage you have to clear them of because if you don't <laughs> you may break down 
and some people do actually break down because they take themselves so much seriously some people cannot accept making mistakes making mistakes is something so weird for them you know and um, that is not something that you want to look at so have fun life is like that everybody must enjoy their lives is once it's once once you're gone you're gone you know the rest is between you and god but once you're here have fun have fun enjoy some bit of life enjoy some bit of life if you have friends if you're single enjoy your singleness don't let anybody use it against you if you have wife or husband try to enjoy it even if it's tough try to enjoy them because that's that was the, the decision that you made actually <laughs> you were waiting for it and now you have it so <laughs> some people enjoy life uh, because they are able to help others what is it that is fun for you what is it that is enjoyment for you some people just are able to you know because of the people that they help they enjoy that process maybe they help widows they help uh, orphans they help elderly people or they go to some classroom and teach you know what is it that you can do beyond your normal lifestyle to add value to another person some people just enjoy that and so have fun have fun um, enjoy your life don't yes there are difficulties there are problems there are things that you remember and like why did i do this you know and the fun does not have to be something that is not good you know some people's idea of fun is so you know going for all the girls drinking and all the other things that are not needed fun can also be something that is positive you know encouraging people helping people around um, sharing what you have some people you give some things to some people and it's, it's, it's fun you can go to the village and um, or you can go to the market or go to some places and maybe you have some thousand cities you want to share it with people at that time that you're doing that i tell you it's fun the joy that you you see on the people's face when you help somebody when you give money to somebody when you give help to somebody when you able to become something that somebody else was looking for that at the moment at that moment the joy on their face also make you enjoy life you know enjoy life so and not everything is you know is it's not like the world is coming to an end and <laughs> enjoy enjoy the wife you have enjoy the children that you have play crack jokes you never know enjoy every moment that you have with people friends family once a while the friend that you have not seen for two years three years that you have always been um, promising them that you come around once a while just go spend some 10 20 minutes together talk with them because it's life it's life it's that short-lived you know before you see it you're 60 years before you see it you're 70 years you're gone okay so don't let every bit of life become pain don't let every every bit of life become pain even the most painful points of life the most painful moment moment of your life can still be an enjoyment state that that which hurt you so much at that point you can still enjoy life it's a choice it's a decision it's consciousness sometimes people don't think it's important but it is it is that which you what is it that you, you like doing because there are people who are driven people who are that much driven you know driven focus success uh, sometimes if you don't take care you overlook the fact that you have to enjoy your life you have to enjoy the journey you have to have fun because yes yeah, it's, it's, it's sometimes i get a bit um, I, I, I you know i look at people like that uh with a second eye where they you, you meet with them they don't even have time to eat they don't have time to talk to you they it's like they have to call this they have to go there. like where are you going man it's good to achieve yes it's good to go it's good to have but sometimes you just have to have fun and somebody told me that uh, in Africa we don't have to have fun no, because there are a lot of problems that we have that if people are enjoying uh, we should not enjoy that say <laughs> it's a good point but uh, I think at least we don't go on a lot of vacation we you know we don't go on a lot of vacations and when people it's not part of our culture we don't even know it you know it's either we are going to work we are going to funeral we are going to party and naming ceremony or we are going to church you know so every one of them uh, can easily become an adult kind of thing for you it becomes um, uh, a painful tax for you and a lot of people are dragging themselves through life to 
to meet all these obligations of life you know all oblig all these obligations of life you have to get up in the morning like the way they say that thank god is friday i don't believe in thank god is friday i think that thank god is monday thank god is tuesday thank god is wednesday thank god thank god is thursday thank god is a friday thank god sunday thank god is saturday you know why because you just have to make the decision to enjoy it so you you you, you work and some people don't like their work because they think that it's, it's below them or the people they work with are not you know good people i don't think so it's a switch you just have to make your decision to say that if i'm here and i'm going to spend my time here i'm going to spend my life here i have to enjoy it i have to find a way of enjoying it even if the if the people are ugly are uh, not good people i don't care once i am here we are going to make it fun at least for me you know because it's my life if it's stay if it's two years that you spend there that two years is not going to come those two years are not going to come back if it's one year that you are spending there that one year is not going to come back so once you are there make it fun for yourself enjoy the life because life was meant to be enjoyed life was meant to be enjoyed so yes it could be something that you are frustrated you don't like it you're unhappy but it's a choice it's a choice it's a choice so that you don't get to a point where you become so much depressed and, and feel hopeless when you don't have fun when you don't enjoy life the tendency is that you become hopeless and and that kind of stress on your body they affect you they affect your growth they affect the way you look they affect your skin they affect your eye they affect every part of your body because the human body was not really created to go through a lot of worry and pain and desperation you know hopelessness that is not good that is not good so you should you know once you have fun you enjoy every now and then have fun have fun have fun even if you, when people disagree with you find a way of making it a joke <laughs> you know but some people like sometimes when you're having discussion especially on the social media or whatsapp or on facebook and some people you know they take their, something so seriously they cannot look like they cannot be criticized or they cannot be disagreed with or they cannot be questioned like wow why cannot why can't you be disagreed with why can't people tell you what they think what what do you so much feel easily insulted why are you god have fun people have the right to say what they want to say and you also have the right to make the choices that you make you know so uh, you, you take so life so seriously you take life so much like that because you think that uh, maybe you are god you know so have fun people write something you don't agree with it doesn't matter you, you put something you put something there and somebody twist it you know and they want to it doesn't matter if i have a way of putting your point across and debate and tell them what you think and let them tell you what they think there's no need for you to become bitter and hateful of something that somebody put on social media in their room sometimes those people may not be able to have the confidence to even say those things in your face but you know the structure is there that anybody at all can call you and, and say anything to you or put anything on, on social media because that's the way it is and you you feel bad and you feel hurt some people can even make a perpetual decision with that that yeah, i will never talk to this guy again <laughs> no. enjoy your life man it's one life enjoy it enjoy it so don't let the problems of life clad you from enjoying your life what are the music that you love the food that you love what is it in spite of all the lack the pain the struggles enjoy life enjoy your life it's a decision to enjoy your life nobody else is responsible for your joy for your peace and for the fun that you have nobody else is responsible i'm not talking of somebody who has to go and work and is there playing ludo or dummy i'm not talking of that i'm talking of somebody who's ambitious who's daring who is trying to get to their goals who is building something but who once in a while would have to just take time to enjoy all the blessings that they have made or oh, you know your all the people around you paying attention to them probably your father is around once a while you talk to them your mother is around once a while you talk to them there's no point trying to fight with everybody around you it, 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 it's unneeded it's unhelpful it's not important you know have fun enjoy people can disagree with you people can say whatever they want to say 
don't become bitter. It's life. <laughs> so enjoy it. <laughs> There's a lot of fun that you can have. Uh, some people, their fun is realizing their dream. And so when you have the dream, when you have the product accepted, when you have the contract signed, when you have the contract uh, finished, have fun. Don't let one of the things that make people that much sad is because they always remember the mistakes, the wrongs, the people who insulted them, the people who gave up on them, the people who ran away on them. Some people have gone through, say, uh, disagreement with their, with their spouses or they have gone through divorces. And sometimes that process makes some people or make some people hold on everything i don't think so they are gone me i wish that they will not go but if they go you still have life to live have fun become the best at what you do you are not god some some things will happen so uh separate you know you, you, you separate yourself from the errors and the mistakes separate yourself from the errors and the mistakes yes you want to become better you want to improve yourself you want to you, if you had the opportunity you will not do it again but uh, be happy so what do you do you just have to live the life that you want you don't like the mistakes and the errors create bitterness and worry and pain in the system because that's how people get sicknesses all kind of sicknesses that they cannot explain because they live in constant bitterness and hatefulness you know they live in constant bitterness and hatefulness or something that somebody has did against them you know their parents or their mother or their father hate them somewhere their brother did something and their sister did something there's no need there's no need to dwell on those you know make your life light make your life so light be so much forgiving and kind you know Everyone has something, somebody that loves them. Get attention. Spend time with those people who love you so much. You never know. Spend time. And that's how you have fun. Once a while. Even the presidents of countries, <laughs> they still have time to go to be with their, with their family. Okay? They have time to go and enjoy and sleep somewhere. But let the country run. After all, when they die, the country will still run away. It will still run anyway. So, um... Sometimes you are, if you are the person who loves helping people, do that. Do that. Enjoy the people around you. Enjoy the things that you have achieved. Um, the friends that you have. Enjoy them. Sometimes they are good, they are bad. It doesn't matter. Enjoy them. Enjoy the people. Enjoy. Have fun. It is easier to enjoy life when you are positive. So be positive of life. Don't be so much negative. Was every, everything they are looking for what didn't work everything they are looking for the negatives they are looking at everything so people are just looking at something negative to hit you and there are, so, and there, there, there are many there are so many people who always have something to say to you to make you feel like you don't have to do this you don't qualify to do that it doesn't matter it's you and it's your life it comes to a time that you just have to be confident in the abilities that you have the power that you have to create the life that you want. Don't let people always talk you down. And don't let people use their position to threaten you and to handle you like you're not a human being. It gets to a point, it has to be your decision. And one of the best decisions that you have to make is to have fun, enjoy your life. Have fun to enjoy your life. You know, enjoy enjoy the life that you want. You no know, people should not you know, some people like controlling people. Some people like controlling people. They are, and one of the people that you you always hear controlling people will be people who are always seeing dream of you getting accident, dying, you know. And God told them it's always about something negative. And when you open your ears to some of these and you give them time, they will always be telling you something. They will come to your workplace and tell you God told them to, this is going to happen. And this is good. and it's always about bad things. They will take the best of life from you. They will take the best, the best of life from you. Because they are trying to be God over you. They are trying to say that God talks to them, but God cannot talk to you. And that's, I think, some, a lot of religious people, people who go to church, don't have, don't, don't enjoy their lives. Because they they, they, they they are trying to go to heaven. <laughs> they are trying to go to heaven. And there is always somebody who is trying to use the name of God to control them. If you hang your life and let another person make all the decisions for your life, 
you will never enjoy your life. It is your life. You have the right over it. You have the right over your life. And you have the right to be responsible for all the errors. And so you also have the right to be responsible and enjoy all the good decisions that you make. So don't hang your life and give your life to another person to control it for you. And a lot of them can control it uh, with all kind of things. Okay? They are the ones who always see all the bad things. You are traveling, they say, don't go, you get accident. They are going anywhere, they say, don't go, you have to come and see me. And a lot of people hang their life and waiting for somebody to always give them some bit of directions. I think that is wrong. You have you have disagreement with your wife and they, every time you're going to another person to come and... Can't you both people agree? Sit down and say that this is the part, this is the solution. This is what I think we should do. Can't you both of them agree and work out something? Then you always try to get to another person to come and tell you everything. Wow. So when they also get up, where do they go? You know, so have fun. Enjoy your life. It's a decision. You cannot, if you cannot accept praise and compliments from people, accept praise and compliments. If you do something, if you're looking nice, let people say you're looking nice and just take it and say, yes, <laughs> I went to buy that shoe myself, man. <laughs> so joke, smile, laugh. It's life. It's important. It's better than you always looking serious, frowning, and, and creating unnecessary fear in, the, in, in your children. And punishing them when they did when they have not done anything wrong, creating all kind of a situation because your children cannot even come close to you because you look so serious every time you're looking serious. They cannot even laugh around you. They cannot even smile. They can say anything. Your wife cannot, you know, joke with you. It's not your wife cannot joke around you at all. You're a very serious man. Oh, have fun. They should be able to come and crack jokes with you. You know. You're not God. You're just as any any one of us. And and really, you're not better than any other person. And nobody is really better than you. Just just position. So if people are that much careful coming to, you know, smile and, you know, have some kind of easiness around you, then there's a problem with you. There's a problem. It means that you are taking things too far. You worry. When people worry, the air around them is thick. They're worried. They're negative. And a lot of people who behave like that think that they are very much serious. Very much serious. And, you know, it's not true. They're not that serious. They just created an atmosphere based on fear. Because you want to control the people around you. And so, have fun. Joke. Have fun with your children. Have fun with your wife. If you have any, if you don't have any, have fun. And um, if somebody disagrees with you, it doesn't mean anything. Somebody disrespect you. What does it mean? So have fun, create fun, and 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 it helps helps you to become a better person. It helps you to become a very effective leader. Okay, if you're light and people can approach you, you know you don't have to put on some kind of pomposity because you think if you need people, if you need to create a scenario, a situation for people to respect you. You have no confidence in yourself. If people cannot overlook you and you not be comfortable, you have no confidence in yourself. If they have to see the house that you have built for you to feel like you're a human being or the car, or they have to refer to you like the doctor or the boss or the manager, before you are confident, you have no confidence in yourself. Okay, you have no pride in yourself. So you you, you have no self-esteem. So you have to create fear and feed on panic from people. But if you have, if you know yourself and you have, if you really develop yourself, then people can laugh, smile, joke around you, and you'll still be fine. Because they have, life is for fun. Life is not, I, I'm not talking of the creating serious situations that we laugh on Facebook with. I'm talking of your life. You're ambitious, you're working, but, you know, Along the line, relax and let people joke and crack jokes and be almost comfortable and, and be approachable. Be approachable. Some, some people should be able to come to you and, and, and ask questions and you'll be comfortable and not be so much hook up to position and title. You know, because one day, one day you leave it anyway. <laughs> one day you leave that position, another person will take it. So, 
uh, have fun and get the best of life 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 so my name is obinako i am talking about enjoy life enjoy life because it's once you live it once okay so if you are that much you know some people you can't even say anything around you're very much you know they look like <laughs> Methuselah. no no the children should be able to you know joke with you if you have any and your friends should be able to joke with you and you don't become so much uh, serious where you don't need to be you know where you don't need to be so what is it that you do for fun you just have to decide some people like cooking some people like dancing they say that i don't know how to dance so i will not say that i dance for fun because i they say that i dance off beat <laughs> which i don't agree but uh, <laughs> they say so maybe they say so i i take it like that you know and uh, some music some music you know play music maybe daddy lumba music or shatawali music or Sarkodia music or Nanai Champong, whatever. Oh, uh, you know, some people say that they're Christian, so they don't dance to any worldly music. <laughs> but they read daily graphic. That's that's how, that's what amazes me. You read daily graphic, but you say that you don't dance to music. Uh, but you read novels. Isn't it the same? It's the same. You watch movies. You watch Jackie Chan movie or John DeMello movie. You think that that's a Christian movie? You know, so just have fun. You know, there are some videos that you like. Some sometimes you can just take a walk. You know, sometimes you can just buy some orange. Sometimes you can just rest and sleep and put everything on hold. Especially when the pressure. There are days that you can see that this day, you wish will come to an end. And 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 the, the life of an entrepreneur is full of those. It's full of those sometimes you can see that this day was very thick don't worry about it just go and play some music or so pick a book and read and clear your head you know the next day will come <laughs> and the next day will come maybe you want to watch football once a while but it's not every day you, you're watching football every day you're watching movie every day you're cooking food every day you're going to the mall no once a while you need to take time to relax relax you know and uh, uh, and just do one of those you know and that's how life is and some people can have fun by helping people some people can have fun by you know achieving their dreams it's all whatever do you call what you, what you call fun is fun but for me if you made a decision to make any decision you know you make it you made a decision to pick a woman to pick a friend to give birth to these children then why not why let those things frustrate you I find it difficult, you know, you know. Don't let those things frustrate you. Even if they are even if they are bad people, the choice is yours to enjoy your life. It's your decision. It's nobody's. If you are always worried and concerned and, and over over you know, some people are so much negatively programmed. They send their children to school, they are thinking, Hey, how about if I'm always go there to take the children? how about if they get accident on the road eh? and you have thought that for 20 years it is not happening and you still worry every day no need have fun you go to school they will come okay sometimes when you are traveling they, they, how about if you get uh, people live in fear but a lot of those don't really come through a lot of those don't really come through and never let another person use those things to control you because one of the things that people don't enjoy life is because people use religiosity to control a lot of people a lot of people uh, you have not read your bible you have not prayed today you have not fasted for two years uh, and they 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 are doing that there's no idea of love and character in them for me if you are practicing those things the first sign that you are practicing those things is that your love goes up goes up a lot you become that much forgiving that much kind compassionate but if you're doing those things and you're still very wicked, unforgiving, jealous, and uh, controversial, you know, unkind, then you didn't meet God. Because if, if, ever, if you ever meet God, God is loving. Oh, God is love. 
you know, it's kind, it's compassionate. Jesus was full of that. So don't let people use their religiosity to control you. Uh, have fun. A lot of them go tell you that this thing you're doing, you don't go to heaven. There's a lot of wrong, wrong, wrong understanding somewhere. If you have to go to heaven because of what you do, then why did he come to die for us? Because you listen to music, you will not go to heaven. Or because you wear that skirt, you, don't, you will not go to heaven. <laughs> you know, so they can do a lot of things. If you're, really, if you're a Christian, a lot of people have said a lot of things that have taken away your, your ability to have um, fun and enjoy life. Because every, almost everything is bordered on sin or no sin. Every, almost everything is bordered on whether you have, you have sin or you have no sin. Almost everything. So it's so, you know, it becomes difficult for people to even enjoy their own lives. You know, so it's, they always live in that kind of panic, you know, and worry. And not sure, not uncertain, uncertainty almost all the time. But enjoy your life. Most fruitful lives are lives that are stable. Most successful lives are lives that are calm. They know themselves. They know their strength. They know what that uh, they know. They know a lot of them can read, cook. You know they are they are they are goal oriented. They work hard. They do all kind of things, but they also have time for things that makes life or that make life more enjoyable. You know, so create that atmosphere yourself to enjoy your life, to enjoy everything that you have, which is a blessing. You know, sometimes the things that you deem as not a blessing, have fun and enjoy them. So my name is, uh, uh, what's my name? My name is Obin Dago. Thank you very much for, for watching. So have fun, have fun, have fun. Even when people cheat you, don't focus all your life. 20 years old, you're worrying about the cheating. When even when you made a lot of mistakes and you, you 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 had a lot of losses in the business, in the middle of that, you still have to enjoy your life. Some people will not be happy seeing you happy. Yes, a lot of people that you have offended get angry when they see a smile on your face. That's a fact of life. People that you have offended, people who have uh, disagreed with you along the line, people who may have taken some offense at your actions get offended when they see you happy when they get offended then when they see you smile uh, but that is life you don't control people's decisions and people's choices people have the right to make their own decision and you have the right to make your own decision and I think that the best of right is make your decision to enjoy your life have fun okay have fun have fun with people who are around you enjoy your life don't suspend your life in the worry mood. Don't suspend your life in the negative mood. Don't suspend your life in the painful mood. You know, don't suspend your life because some people run away from you. Some people say they don't want to associate with you again. Somebody wants to associate with you. <laughs> so if the other ones don't want to associate with you, what can you do? Nothing. The ones that are left, enjoy your life with them. Sometimes you have no money. But you can buy, maybe, you can buy some, what is it, uh, some corn or some plantain somewhere, the roasted ones. It doesn't really matter. You know, some people, when they don't have money in their pockets, they become moody, sad, they cry, they become hopeless. Until you're able to overcome that state life will be much, much tough for you until you have been able to overcome the lack state your, your joy and your ability to enjoy life should not depend on the fact that you don't have money it's tough that is true sometimes you don't have what to eat drink water but don't kill yourself let that be a motivation to change the situation. Some people, the lack is all that they think about. They think about the lack, they think about the things that they don't have, they, are, they think about the things that they think are just half. Planning to improve your life should be different from worrying about your life. You want to become better, but that's not mean that you have to worry. 
Because worrying takes the joy out of your life. And when the joy is out of your life, your body becomes prone to a lot of diseases. That's why people break down. Because they create a lot of hopelessness. The body needs hope to live. <laughs> uh, so no matter what happens, you don't have money. Especially the business people. There is always every moment there is something that will take your joy. There is something that will disturb you. There is something that will create lack. There is something, there is some mistake somewhere. There is disagreement somewhere. There is something that is always taking something out of you. As a business person, as an entrepreneur, you should live life beyond that. Beyond that. Or you live in pain all your life. Or you live in pain all your life. You should not live in the pain. No. Enjoy your life. Have fun. Enjoy life. Focus on the vision. Work every day towards it. But don't cry. Don't weep. Set your goals. Have fun. Have fun. If anybody goes, have fun. Don't cry. Let them go and enjoy their lives. You to enjoy your life. Yes, it was painful. It was a mistake. You didn't like it. But enjoy your life. There's no need spending your life worrying about that which <laughs> Somebody ran away with your money. And every day that you think about it, your heart will... Ah, this guy ran away with my money and it's never come back. Enjoy your life. You ran away with your money. But you can create that money as well. Perhaps, if you clear your head, you may be able to think of the possibilities to create more money than what they stole. You know? Than what they stole. Maybe some people came to steal from you, con you, dupe you, cheated you, and that pain has rest has has rested in your heart for years. That is preventing you from enjoying your life. <laughs> How fun! Because in your bed to get to goals and to, to achieving anything, a lot of people will cross your path. Some of them will cheat you, some of them will lie, some of them will run away. Enjoy your life. Enjoy your life. No matter who disagrees with you, no matter who run, run away from you, you have the right to enjoy the life that you have. Nobody has a right but you to enjoy the life that you have. So. Uh, my name is Ovidako. Let me recap the things that I said. That uh, you know, people who are driven uh, uh, easily can lose fat, sight of the fact that life was was created in the first place to be enjoyed. You know, it's fun. Yes, you have to achieve your goals. You have to get all those, but uh, you cannot live in worry and pain all your life. There's something around your life that you can enjoy. You know, there are so many problems in life. School fees. Theft, uh, loans, collapse of business and, and relationships, all kind of things happen in this life. And they are happening every day. If your attention is on them, you'll never enjoy your life, okay? You should. You should. They will happen. Let them happen. And there should be something that you do for fun. What is it that you enjoy? Is it reading of books? Is it chatting with friends? Is it arguing with people? Is it videos? Is it music? Is it food? What is it that you, is it dressing? Some people like going to the mall to buy clothes and wear them. And, yes, once in a while, what is wrong with that? Maybe you like buying nice shoes. <laughs> Go and buy one nice shoe and, and wear them. You never know. You know, I remember that when I was uh, somewhere and uh, my, my big mother, my mother's senior sister, gave me money. That time was very uh, $100, I think, that time. She lived in another country. She gave me the money. I went somewhere and bought a very nice shoe. And then I wore that shoe in the night. And my mother was uh, <laughs> laughing at me that when you buy a shoe, you wear the shoe in, in, the, in the morning or in the afternoon, not in the night that nobody will see. <laughs> you know, when I buy something new, I wear it. I don't know. I don't want the next day to come. I want to wear it that day. 
so have fun you know what is the point buying it if you are going to put it there i don't know so that is life have fun with your children have fun with those around you your husband it doesn't have to be always hostility you know and um, an aggression separate yourself from the mistakes i said and uh, there is somebody who always loves you enjoy the relationship enjoy that don't take them for granted you know some people like helping people and that is fun and people enjoy everybody around you and uh, take it easy if you're a very negative person life is remorseful <laughs> and what is the english word life is um it's not remorseful uh, life is bitter you know if if you are the kind who is very negative and, or and pessimistic so i uh, change that uh, view of life try to look into the positive in situations look at the positive a little you know even if it's hard for you and uh, when somebody gives you compliments and praise you or something take them don't brush them off <laughs> and jokes create jokes smile and laugh that's one life that you all have and make the best use out of it don't let the financial problems and the, 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 the relationship problems because these are the things that actually will make people worry financial problems relationships marriages friendships children work business partners health issues career education these are the things that worry a lot of people uh, they should not worry you they're part of life you know so even in the in, in a situation where they are still pressure is still there have fun okay solve them but um, don't die okay and tend to uh, enjoy those things that you have and so i think it's more better in life to enjoy the, the, the one life that you have than worrying every day than worrying every day it doesn't worth it, it doesn't worth it having fun does not mean you're lazy having fun does not mean that you're not ambitious having fun does not mean that uh, you, you you don't want to become successful it's part of the process actually you don't need to become bitter and regretful in your bid to get to your goals. It doesn't matter. You know, even the very successful people with a lot of half time to enjoy relationships and half time to enjoy their lives. So no matter what you've been through, no matter what you have gone through, uh, those happened and uh, correct them and amend those that you can amend. If you need to apologize to some people, you may have to do that, but uh, enjoy your life enjoy the life that you have and it's one of the best ways to keep young and to keep healthy you know people who grow the gray hair easily some of them are genetic but a lot of them are people who worry a lot some people they are very young 30 years but you look them you look at them and they look like 60 because they let the the stress of life overcome them the stress of life overcome them one of the best medicines to to keep young and to keep active is to have fun, enjoy your life, reduce the worry if you can take the worry out. Even in the midst of people disagreeing and fighting you and, and, and hitting back at you, you can still enjoy your life. There's no need to cry over things that, you know, never be afraid of opposition, never be afraid of problems, never be afraid of threats, never. If they come, you deal with them as they come. Problems, difficulties, deal with them as they come and solve them as they come. Solve them as a human being, but have time not to worry. Have fun. Enjoy your life. Because life, until you don't know whether you know or not, is full of problems. So you cannot say that because problem has come, uh, and I'm, I'm going to weep and cry. Have fun. Take charge of your life. It's your, it's your own life. Don't let anybody take you. Your, your joy and your happiness is your sole responsibility. Nobody can make you happy. You have to make yourself happy. You might you, you have to make yourself at peace. You have to make yourself uh, live the life that you want. So thank you very much for watching. Thank you.